uh, on my channel section you'll see a bunch of uh, a list with a bunch of death threats. Uh, it, the channel names of people who sent me death threats. Now, the way this works is that they have to send me a specific message telling me that they personally would wish to do, in, in a sense, this is a declaration that given the opportunity, they would personally try to kill me. Okay, because if they're not specifically saying that, then I don't put their name up there. Islam claims to be a religion of peace. All right, well, let's test that. Okay, let's, let's see if it is. Now, that fun fundamentalist video is about the most childish, silliest thing I could come up with. And, and I'm, it was bound to offend people because I, there's a lot of Muslims that are actually that childish. And um, because it's such a big issue, everybody's made it into... Otherwise, it would just be a cartoon. Honestly, it was, a, it was a, somebody had to point that out to me, you know, like, I mean, I heard about this cartoon that everybody got so worked up about, and I saw it and I'm like, that's it? That's, that's a cartoon? I mean, in order to make that video, you know, funnier, I mean, I had to even animate that cartoon, because <laughs> it's just not funny we have this straight-faced individual continuously, boom, blow up on a shot. I had to, you know, animate it a bit. If there's somebody that's stupid enough, <laughs> to actually send me a death threat, I will exploit the hell out of them. Thank you. Thank you, man. Because what you've done is something I could never do. You see, I can whinge and whine that Islam is a, is a really, you know, dangerous, violent place, but by actually sending me a death threat, what you've done is given me a first-hand weapon that I can, I get, this is a first-hand account of somebody that I am in direct contact with who is a Muslim who wants to kill me for insulting Islam. Boy, did you ever step in it. The more, the more death threats I get, <laughs> the more justified I am to be here. Because, you know, <laughs> If somebody says Islam is a religion of peace, I can just hold up that list and say, would you like to see copies of each one of these death threats? Because I keep copies of them, so I can refer to them. And, uh, <laughs> oh my God, I can't believe people actually fall for this. You know, I, I'd be as, I'm, as, in a sense, as honest as possible. I display them. It's the first freaking thing on my, on my channel, information. And people still fall for it. It's amazing. Now, underneath the death threat section, there's a section that says people who think I, who, who think that I should be killed for, for um, insulting Islam. And w what those are is people who've sent me back comments saying, yes, you know, people who do this should be killed. But the difference they've made is they've not personally said, I'm going to fucking kill you, you bitch. So it's not, a, it's not a threat stating that they would personally do me violence. What it is is a threat saying that they would support somebody doing me violence. So. Um, it's, a, it's a really subtle difference, but it's, it's, it's enough of a difference to separate the categories. It's important to actually list the dangerous people. You know, because there might be a lot of people that dislike me, whatever, dislike what I'm doing. Okay, but I don't give a shit if you don't like my stuff. Okay, what I give a shit about is whether you want to try and kill me or injure me for my right to freedom of speech, and that absolutely does include insulting religion. In fact, freedom of speech includes absolutely anything. So let me put this another way, because some people have been getting back to me asking, well, what if I say this on your channel? Or what if I say that? Or what if we do this? You guys, freedom of speech means freedom of speech, okay? There is nothing you can say that I will ban you for. Nothing. Try it. Tr tr try it, you guys. Just, you know, have fun. Be reckless, okay? And I think you'll find that the sky will not fall in if people swear. <laughs> I think you will find that the world does not stop spinning, that civilization does not come to a grinding halt, and looters and uh, pillagers just go running wild through the streets. If somebody says, Oh, fucking Christ! Who gives a shit? I don't see lightning bolts coming down from the sky, guys. It's all open. Even the people who threaten me, they're still, they're still able to leave channel comments. But so I'd love for them to incriminate themselves further. Because in, I, I'm prepared, when I, when I, I'm, I'm counting on it, actually, is that uh, religion incriminates itself. In a sense, if you give it enough rope, 
it will eventually hang itself. There's no need for me to ban it, to say that religion will one day become illegal. That's about the stupidest fucking thing you could possibly say. It really is. Because what that does is it justifies every single fear that those fundamentalists have, that if they don't adamantly stick to their guns, that their religion will become outlawed. Don't you see that that justifies their paranoia? That's a stupid thing to say. Because you know what, frankly, if anybody ever did try to make it illegal, I'd be on their side. Because that, if you were to make religion illegal, if you were to make, if you were to try to handcuff their fucking beliefs and, and, and you know, try to get inside their head and say, no, 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 you, you can't believe in this. You have to believe in something else. If you try to, you know, ban the Bible or the Torah or the Quran, fucking Christ, man, I am on their side. You don't need to ban religion to, to marginalize it. All you need is freedom of speech. That's the only weapon you need. That's it. You don't need anything else. You don't need laws. You don't need, you don't need bans. You don't <laughs> need anything like that. That, that, would, that would be a mistake to do that. You don't have to make borders. You, you, fuck that crap, okay? You guys, you don't need it. Okay, from now on, guys, if somebody sends me a video and a asking me to flag it, then what I'm going to do is I'm going to watch the whole video. And if the video does not contravene uh, YouTube's terms of use, then I am going to cut off my friends link to that person. And I'm going to leave a channel comment just saying why I've done that. Okay, guys, because you know what? Freedom of speech is for everybody, okay? Not just Christians, not just Muslims, not just atheists, not just any freaking prick, okay? It's for everybody. What I do is I make friends with people until I can find a reason not to. Like, like say, somebody brings to my attention that so-and-so, who um, I have a friend's link to on YouTube, has been making racist comments, or has a racist comment, or has been making threats against somebody, or is making threats of physical violence, okay? If, if somebody brings that to my attention, or if I see that, on somebody's channel and the person who's making those threats happens to be my friend on YouTube or has a friend link to me on YouTube, I will disconnect um, my, my friend's link with them straight away because uh, I don't want them, in a sense, making me look bad, <laughs> okay? Because I'm perfectly capable of being an asshole on my own and I don't like their particular way of doing things. So um, I don't want anybody connected with me in any way who goes around threatening people. I don't want anybody connected with me who um, is a racist. And that includes Nazi fucking white supremacist motherfucking assholes. Get the fuck off my channel.